The journals of the Continental Congress record Wednesday, September 7th, 1774, 9 o'clock a.m. Agreeable to the resolve of yesterday, the meeting was opened with prayers by Reverend Mr. Jacob Duche, voted that the thanks of Congress be given to Mr. Duche for performing divine service and for the excellent prayer which he composed and delivered on the occasion. Reverend Duche had prayed, O God of wisdom, direct the counsel of this honorable assembly that the scene of blood may be speedily closed, that truth and justice, religion and piety prevail. John Adams wrote, Reverend Duche read the 35th Psalm. After this, unexpectedly to everybody, he struck out into an extemporary prayer which filled the bosom of every man present. I must confess, I never heard a better prayer. The Library of Congress printed on a historical placard of Carpenters Hall, Philadelphia, Washington was kneeling there with Henry, Randolph, Rutledge, Lee, and Jay, and by their side there stood, bowed in reverence, the Puritan patriots of New England. It was enough, said Mr. Adams, to melt a heart of stone. I saw tears gush into the eyes of the old grave Pacific Quakers of Philadelphia.